I got, I got, I got, I got. Here's your five-man stepladder field chasing the USBC Masters crown. Cooley and Tease all international match one. Three seed Jason Belmonte chases his fifth Masters crown. Your top two seeds, Dombrowski and D. Ron Booker, are seeking their first ever wins on the tour. Sam Cooley, the four seed from Australia, taking on the Englishman, Richard Teese. And Teese will start us off. Randy? Two Aussies and this, uh, this gentleman here from England on our telecast today. And a couple unknowns, if you will. And how about the story for Patrick Dombrowski? We'll get into that in a little bit. Here's Richard Teese to start us off here at the Masters. We start, folks, back-to-back -back jacks. Be that right lane. Cooley, the number four seed, he gets the choice of starting lane in this match. As we take a look at his arsenal, he's going with Crimson Jackal. And I know how you like the names oh, I do. of some of the equipment. Oh, <laughs> uh, that 10 pin is going to stand. I'm sorry, what was it called? The Crimson, Crimson Jackal. How do, how do you feel about that? The Crimson Jackal. Jackal. Yeah. Who do we got to talk to? Do you know anybody? I, I I know a couple of people. Storm? Anybody? Cooley? Cleans that one up. Masters? 44 feet in length. And originally, the players were going to try to start a little bit straighter, a little bit farther to the outside part of the lane. That You see that red line, but that's certainly not the case right now. They're both in, and they're both opening up this pattern. And the winner of this one to take on your three seed, the man who has done it. 15 times on the major stage, Jason Belmonte, maybe the greatest bowler ever. Oh. Woof. Gave it away. Open frame. This will be his best finish of the season. There we go. On the left lane, Cooley. The whiff spare in the fifth frame, the bad shot in the third. Tease did have a 300 game this week. There was only four in qualifying. Match play, Deron Booker had one. But interestingly, it's where they qualified. Richie Tease qualified 53rd. Sam Cooley, third. Clean it up, Richie. There we go. They absolutely did because most of the players that are international, they headed home. However, Sam elected to travel to Lockport, New York to practice daily with Brad Angelo of Bowl U. Then he took calls with Rick Benoit in Kansas to hammer out a strategy for the Masters. Now, clearly, that plan panned out because Sam specifically worked on shallower angles, which he says was instrumental to him this week. Hey, Kimberly, real quick. Uh, Lockport, New York, that's in upstate New York or... It it's in Western, Western New, York. New York. Sorry, yes, Western New York. I've never met anybody who's defended Western New York. Cooley in the ninth, way right of target. Hmm. Well, last couple of shots inside of target, both go high for Sam Cooley, bud. It's over. Yeah. Tees has taken off the audio pack. He's done. The regular shot. So Cooley moves on. Your four seed advances. He'll take on your three seed and four time Masters champ Jason Belmonte next. Dombrowski and D. Ron Booker still waiting in the wings here in Vegas at the USBC Masters. So the major goat set to take the hardwood. Jason Belmonte looking for his record 16th major. On the major scene, far and away, Jason Belmont. We open up our second match, Sam Cooley. 100%, that three week break allowed him to rest. Feel like I'm 30 again. Uh-oh, watch out. There, you know, it takes essentially kind of two days. It takes almost a week for your body to adapt and then you be up to a nickel slot and do anything. I'm probably get it probably get a bevy. I'm more a Reno guy. Oh, oh boy. Wow. What a Oh yeah. This car 
Bears. That'd be a blast. Let's make it happen. This guy's been in one. Belmo in the fourth. Late drop of the 10. There's the hook on the left lane, Rob. It's, we had a graphic up with his arsenal. He's using a tour dynamics. This lane is on fire already, and we're only in game two. Boyd chopping the three off the six. Would have been cool if you could have telestrated that. <laughs> on the telecast today, 39 and all toll. Life through the loser's bracket, right? Yeah. Oh, Gone the survivor of this Belmonte Cooley matchup. <laughs> Liked it and got it. We welcome you back to Fox Sports coverage of the USBC Masters. 2013, the first Masters win for Jason Belmonte. Took care of Wes Malott, finished with six straight strikes. 2014 in Jersey, dropped E.J. Tackett. Next year in Green Bay, took care of A.J. Johnson. And then 2017 in Vegas, dropped Michael Tang. You're all ready for Sam Cooley. Messenger! Everybody was juiced up this morning. Whoa! Another four left before he threw his, this, the shot the sixth. Hello. There's your speed control. Let's uh, compare the two lanes for Belmo here. Left lane with the red, right lane in the blue. Yeah, and obviously a, a much deeper path, but I I think the left lane hooks more. In that left lane. It, I, I think the two colors were backwards. Because it's he's way deep. Randy, you way know I deep. didn't make the graphic, right? I know you did. Oh no! And it opened. There you go. What's that? Ball reaction to be nice and even. So this shot with an eye on the third match. That one's going to go back in the bag, I think. Yeah. I mean, after that, he did get it wide, 2 4 10, but I'm not sure that's the ball he's going to go with. He will finish in fourth. Look forward to seeing more of him as the season progresses. But it's Belmo, your three seed, moving on to your third match. Up next for him, your two seed, Patrick Dombrowski. Kimberly standing by with Belmo. Jason, congratulations on advancing now. Number three here at the third major of the season, the USBC Masters. Jason Belmonte, the three seed, will start us off on the right lane. Make that the left lane. Gave me a head fake, good, Randy. Good catch. <laughs> You're on fire. Great, You're great on start fire. to the third match, Rob. You're on fire today. Look at how deep that is. And look at the challenge he left him. Ooh, that was close. Mm -hmm, if, good he, go. if he moves any farther left, he's going to have to go airborne because he's running out of lane on that, on that left lane. You think he's going to go airborne? Well, I think based on the last shot he just threw, he might and just get softer with his speed. Maybe move in a little bit, get a little softer, see if he can get it to come around the corner. 23 years on the tour, zero titles yet for Patrick Dombrowski. Big Buckeye fan. Little scarlet and gray kick there to get all 10 down. He's going with fate. And he's 10 boards right of Belmonte on that right lane. Say he's, he's going with fate. He's going with a ball called fate. Now Belmo quickly against the wall. That's how you respond. Just catch the wrong guy on the wrong pair twice in a row, you're out. Back on that left lane. Messenger! Oh. Get down! 
Dombrowski on the right. Three in a row. He's got a very special person watching right now. I'll tell you about that in a second. Mm. Three in a row now. That's code for somebody's going to take my money. Messenger! Not enough protein this morning. Ball that that is? Who that belongs to? That's Belmonte's ball. I like that. Speaking of fate, right? Yeah. Fate doing you in. Watching that. <laughs> That's not my game, man. No. Oh boy, there's that left lane. Good shot. Yeah, and, and just watching where he's playing and where Belmonte's playing, it's like head scratcher, right? It's like, how can he possibly play that part of the lane? It's got to be bone dry there. Oh, oh man. Oh, almost. Working on a spare. So you're a grinder, is that what you're telling me? You want grinder? I think, I think, I think Mange, Major should be grinders. Okay. Back on the strike train is Belmo. High game so far today, 222. 222 from Belmo in our last game. As far as one element is concerned, Randy, his approach. Messenger, oh. got it! Man. That was like a helicopter messenger coming over and just kicking the tent out. <laughs> he says, it's given me more time to focus, to prepare, to improve my game. Big strike right there in his office. Great human being. Yep. Belmo, in the eighth, working off a strike. Five pin match. Curls it in. Didn't like it. Did not hook. Oh, just to the side. Dombrowski, huge shot in the tent, on the left. Left the seven. In the catbird seat right now and ready to pounce. Uh, whatever this ends up being here in the tent, fires up next week. Yep in Detroit. After that, the TOC. I mean, the back half of this PBA season is loaded with opportunities for people, including this man, Belmo. Needs a mark. Way right of target. Are you kidding me? Should have stopped. Why didn't I? I, I can't have keep up. Why didn't I? With this pendulum of momentum, this is insane. He's got to convert this. Why didn't I stop? Oh. Patrick Dombrowski moves on to the title match at the USBC Masters. He had it, he lost it, and he got it back again. Unbelievable finish. Dombrowski, native of Parma, Ohio, just south of Cleveland, starts us off on the left lane. Great start, Patrick. Great start. Mexico, originally from Pomona, California. If you are a regular at the Starlight Bowling Bar and Grill, you know this smiling face from the Starlight Pro Shop. First shot on television, and he almost went Brooklyn. Oh, he went Brooklyn. Almost struck. Trying to win a title against. That better hook. On the left lane, and it does. Went on down. Did some winning as well. Trying to do some more winning today. Dombrowski 
Oh, I had a run. At a premium. And there's an open. Another open. Won the showcase showdown with a $1 bid. Yeah, don't go over, man. Yeah, because he thought the, the, uh, the other contestant was way over. Savvy. Picks that one up. Kind of took a break, rejoined it. About the age of 12, junior amateur tours. Worked in pro shops for the last decade. Took some time off for bowling. Worked at Bed Bath & Beyond. Back to bowling. There's his arsenal and his, his ball rep, Tim Mack, doing a lot of work. D gets all 10. Just a... Back to Dombrowski. Off that open frame in the third, responds. Hates it again. Yep, right through the nose. Oh, man. Open frame. E. Ron Booker. Dombrowski's got to find a counter punch. Open frame in the fifth. Here he is in the sixth. Get down! Double for Dom. First strike on the right lane. Could be watching history today, folks. Wait, wait, yes, wait, 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 get yes, in your home! Good. Today is your day! How about the last two strikes? That trip 4-9 and then the roller 10. Dombrowski down 30, trying to make a late charge. Oh my goodness. Collapsing and doesn't. One down, only two frames left. On, All right, let's make it interesting. Whoa. Lee needs a mark to join these two people, George Branham and Gary Faulkner Jr. as African Americans to win on the PBA Tour. Yeah, not just any wins, majors. Majors. George Branham the third, great friend of mine. We used to room together. We grew up in Southern California, bowling juniors together. And then Gary Faulkner. Booker. The strike, oh, oh, spinning, oh, no. won't get it. Has to make this. Hit it, drops it, two pins away from his first tour title. Uh-huh. What a performance, incredible. This entire game for Booker. For the Masters! He's got it! Get it. Get History on Fox. Yeah. Again. You can see the eyes right now. King Booker trying to keep it tight, but it is tough. Look at that smile. It is beautiful. Dombrowski, what a run here. Hope to see much more of him on the back half of the PBA Tour. But D. Ron Booker is the story.